Well, hey there, rock stars. Sarah Rock and Robbins here coming to you live with a very quick closing tip of the day. As we get started, let's get acquainted. Shout out who you are and where you're tuning in from. And as you share, I'm going to quickly tell people who I am. I am Sarah Robbins. I'm a former kindergarten teacher turned to one of network marketing's very top female leaders. Together with our team, we built a $2 billion sales team, over 300,000 distributors, and I share how we did it in my best-selling book, Good for Any Network Marketer, Rock Your Network Marketing Business. You can also find more courses and resources from me at sarahrobbins.com. Today on our free training, we are going to be talking about how to conquer the close and crush common objections and how to be sure that every single person you talk to becomes a customer or a business partner. Does that excite anybody else? Yes, every single person. These are three quick tips that really all boil down to a couple of quick questions that is going to help you to crush objections and conquer the close. All right, so our three quick tips for today. Number one, this one is called the share with a friend method. Oftentimes when I talk to people, or even as you talk to your customers about the business, you want to determine where would they best fit into the business as a customer or as a business partner. Now, some of you guys, maybe you struggle with leading the business. So this can really be a good method for you as well. When talking to people about my company, I like to ask them one simple question. Can you envision sharing the product with a few of your friends? Again, can you envision sharing the product with a few of your friends? If they say yes, then I talk to them about the benefits of becoming a distributor. You know, some of the discounts, the benefits, et cetera. It's kind of like upselling them into the business. If they say, no, no, I don't really imagine sharing this with a few of my friends, I just wanna use it, great. I sign them up and I tell them about the benefit of becoming my customer and all of our customer programs. Now here's why this matters. I really want you to listen in. If they don't envision telling anybody and they just want to use the product as a customer, you should sign them up as a customer and here's why. You get the long-term benefit of them ordering and perhaps reordering again. But if they say, maybe I could envision sharing it with a few people, or maybe I do want to hear about your distributor discount and all of the benefits. It would benefit you to sign them up in the business. And here's why. The difference between one point of sale versus multiple points of sales is they share with their friends, multiple points of distribution. So really linear income versus leveraged income. Okay. All right. That's step or tip number one. Number two, our second tip for closing, our second method, is the scale from one to 10 method. Now, I really love this one. So another great question when closing, okay, you've shared the opportunity with people, you can ask them this very simple question. On a scale from one to 10, how interested are you in company XYZ? So on a scale from one to 10, how interested are you? One, meaning you are so excited about the product and you'd love to join us as a customer, or 10, you're intrigued by the business. You'd love to get the products at a great discount and maybe join our fun and fast growing team. So one, meaning you're interested in the product, 10, meaning you're interested in joining the business and getting great benefits on the product. Do you notice I didn't say one to 10, one meaning not interested at all? No, because I believe everybody can plug into our business. I call it the three C's and I talk about it in my book, customer, consultant, or connector. If they're not interested, they can provide you referrals too. You say, who do you know this would be great for? Okay, I'd at least like to plug everyone in at a minimum into our products as a customer. Now, if they say anything less than a 10, but you're thinking, gosh, I'd be great at the business, or maybe they're somewhere in the middle. I love this one question. This is a million dollar tip. So make sure you share this training with your team or tag them later or do a little watch party on your team page. They've got to hear this because you're losing a ton of business if your team isn't asking this one question, okay? 
imagine if everybody they talk to, I mean, everyone plugged into the business some way, somehow, whether customer or consultant, a lot of times people just stop at the no and they don't bring the conversation further. So here's a million dollar question for you. So I'm curious, what would make you a 10? I'm going to say that again. So just curious, what would make you a 10? And here's the cool thing. When you ask that question, that uncovers any leftover objections. Then you can handle the objection and ask them to get started. Okay, that brings me to tip number three, the simple ask. You have not if you ask not. So get your ask, A-S-K, in gear. At the end of every conversation, ask people, how would you like to get started? A customer and get these benefits or a consultant and get these benefits. I like try to like to try to upsell them to become a consultant. So for my company, I would say, as a customer, get 10% off in free shipping, or as a consultant and get the products at the deepest discount, wholesale price, and maybe earn them for free or some extra money as you simply use them and tell other people about them. So those are the three methods that I use to close. And I do hope that it helps you to crush your clothes, conquer common objections, and get more customers and consultants for your team. And if it did, make sure you share this with a friend. If you want more training like this, check out my closing and objections course at sarahrobbins.com. When you click on the store, Sarah with a H, Robbins with two B, sarahrobbins.com. Click on the store, check out the closing and objections course. I go over every common objection that you get in the business and how to crush it. But if you want ongoing training with me on more topics to help you rock your network marketing business, join us for weekly coaching at coachwithsarah.com. When you join, you actually get all of the classes that I offer on my website for free, plus weekly coaching with me, and you get to be a part of the most supportive and collaborative community in network marketing. Again, coachwithsarah.com. All right, guys, did you enjoy today's free training? If so, make sure you tag a friend or share it on your pages or maybe even in the inbox. The more who know, the greater your team will grow. Have a great day, guys. God bless and goodbye for now. And rock on, rock stars. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.